80 Pup or Bust. On the Friday edition of Gold Rush, Tony Beats, Aka the Dutchman, has a situation that is not a laughing matter as he is down millions of dollars. Tony has a new granddaughter, and they say babies bring good luck, but the hits keep coming for the colorful Tummy Beats, whose entire family is in on the business at this point, and he needs a reversal of fortune fast. The exclusive preview for TV shows Ace shows a replay from last season's water disaster, but will the lousy streak keep going, or is he due for a break? Almost halfway through the season, Tony Beats, the king of the Klondike, is struggling to recover from a significant blow. Dropping more than $5 million on new equipment to open his Indian River claims, only to be denied a water license. Now he's swinging wildly. The 80 pup cut is days away from being mined out, and Tony desperately needs another quick hit to fill the Beats family coffers. Last season, Tony pulled 2,000 ounces out of the mega cut and believed the previous section would be the richest in gold, but before he could mine it, disaster struck. Water breached the dirt dams and filled his cuts up, so they could not process any pay dirt. Seemingly distracted by the circumstance, he says, 80 pup is not going to last forever. So now it is time you know to check out these spots that a guy keeps an eye on for, but he just can't get there. So here we are digging some holes. His only daughter Monica Beats had a baby girl. On August 14, she posted a family picture on her Facebook page. A few episodes back, we met Monica's first child Jasmine and saw how Minnie Beats was in love with her grandchild and simply over the moon babysitting her. But Tommy needed a competent extra hand and maternity leave ended. Monica was mixed emotions as she described how her daughter's presence had softened Tony a bit. He also noted in that episode that without his kids, he'd beef asterisk 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 ed. Ah, the entire episode leads to the finale, and the race is on for Beats, Ness, Schnabel, and Lewis, as fan favorites like Juan Ibarra and Freddie Dodge make appearances. Brandon has reskinned the trommel in two days and saved Tommy $85,000, and as the Dutchman says, that's a good day. Meanwhile, Lewis and company are at California Creek, and they could use some breaks too. And how many people think that Juwan and Freddie should have another season of Freddie Dodge's Mine Rescue? They are great together. How look at what Tommy is dealing with this week. In addition to watching the series on Discovery, viewers can check out new episodes each week on Discovery Go. Additionally, viewers can join the conversation on social media by using the hashtag GoldRush.